Hello everyone, and welcome back to another exciting edition of Coffee with Karen, where we spill the tea on Bollywood's biggest stars. Today, we're diving deep into the financial world of the incredibly talented Urmila Matondkar. You might have heard the recent news about her separation from her husband, Mohsin Akhtar Mir, after seven years of marriage. It's certainly a difficult time for her, and we wish her all the best. Ermela's journey has been nothing short of inspiring. From her early days as a child artist to becoming a reigning queen of Bollywood in the 90s, she's captivated audiences with her acting prowess and captivating screen presence. But beyond the glitz and glamour, Ermela has also dabbled in politics, showcasing her multifaceted personality. Remember her iconic roles in films like Rangila, Judai and Satya? She wasn't just a pretty face. She brought depth and emotion to every character she portrayed. And let's not forget her stunning dance moves. Ermila's contribution to Indian cinema is undeniable. But enough about her on-screen charisma, let's get down to business. Or should I say, her net worth. In 2019, Ermila entered politics. She contested the Lok Sabha elections from Mumbai North. Candidates must disclose their financial assets. Urmila's net worth was 68 crores. This includes her assets and investments. She had movable assets worth 50 crores and immovable assets worth 18 crores. She paid significant taxes, proving her responsibility. Urmila Matonkar like any savvy investor, has a diverse portfolio that includes a mix of properties and investments. Her real estate holdings are nothing short of impressive. She owns multiple properties in prime locations across Mumbai, the city of dreams. One of her most prized possessions is her luxurious bungalow in Bandra, one of Mumbai's most affluent neighborhoods. This sprawling abode is estimated to be worth crores and reflects her exquisite taste. But wait, there's more. Urmila also owns apartments in other posh areas of Mumbai, including Andheri and Juhu. These properties not only provide her with a comfortable lifestyle, but also serve as valuable investments that appreciate over time. Apart from real estate, Ermela has also made strategic investments in various financial instruments. She understands the importance of diversifying her portfolio and securing her financial future. Now, let's talk about something that every Bollywood star loves, luxury cars. Ermela Matondkar is no exception. Her garage is a testament to her love for high-end vehicles. One of the most eye-catching cars in her collection is a sleek Mercedes-Benz. This luxurious sedan is a symbol of sophistication and style, and Ermela carries it off with effortless grace. But that's not all. Ermela also owns a BMW, known for its performance and sporty appeal. This car perfectly complements her dynamic personality. Her car collection is a reflection of her success and her desire to enjoy the finer things in life. After all, who wouldn't want to cruise around Mumbai in style? Section 5. Mohsin Akhtar Mir. A look at her husband's assets. Now, let's talk about Urmila's husband, Mohsin Akhtar Mir. He's a successful businessman from Kashmir and has made a name for himself in the world of fashion. While his net worth is not publicly known, it's safe to say that he's doing quite well for himself. Mossin owns a successful clothing line that caters to the modern Indian man. His designs are known for their intricate embroidery and contemporary silhouettes. He's dressed many Bollywood celebrities, adding to his credibility in the fashion industry. Apart from his fashion ventures, Mohsin is also involved in various other businesses. He's a shrewd investor and has a keen eye for profitable opportunities. While Ermila and Mohsin are now separated, 
their combined net worth during their marriage was undoubtedly substantial. They were considered one of the power couples of Bollywood, known for their elegance and sophistication. Section 6. Debts and Liabilities. A Balanced Perspective. Now, while we've been gushing over Urmila Matondkar's assets, it's essential to remember that every financial portfolio has two sides. Like any responsible individual, Ermila also has certain debts and liabilities. Her financial disclosures during the 2019 elections revealed that she had taken loans from banks and financial institutions. These loans could be for various purposes, such as investments, property purchases, or personal expenses. It's important to note that having debts is not necessarily a negative thing. In fact, it's quite common for individuals, especially high net worth individuals like Urmila, to leverage debt for investments and business ventures. What matters is that her liabilities are well within her means and that she has a sound financial plan to manage her debts effectively. Section 7. Estimating Urmila Matondkar's net worth. So, after taking into account her assets, investments and liabilities, what's Urmila Matondkar's estimated net worth? While it's challenging to give an exact figure without access to her private financial records, we can make an educated guess based on the information available. Considering her real estate holdings, luxury car collection, investments, and her successful career in Bollywood, it's safe to say that Ermela Matondka's net worth is estimated to be in the range of 70 to 80 crores. This makes her one of the wealthiest actresses in Bollywood, a testament to her hard work, talent, and smart financial decisions. Ermela's story is an inspiration to many aspiring actors and entrepreneurs. It shows that with dedication, talent and a bit of luck, one can achieve great heights of success. Section 8. A Shift in Political Allegiance Now, let's address the elephant in the room, shall we? Ermela's political journey has been quite an interesting one. She joined the Indian National Congress in 2019 and even contested the Lok Sabha elections. However, she later resigned from the party, citing petty in-house politics as the reason for her departure. In a surprising turn of events, she joined the Shiv Sena, a regional political party in Maharashtra in 2020. This move raised many eyebrows and sparked debates about her political ideologies. Some speculated that her decision was driven by political opportunism, while others defended her right to choose a party that aligned with her beliefs. Whatever the reason, Ermela's political journey has been full of twists and turns. Only time will tell what the future holds for her in the realm of politics. Section 9 Conclusion Ermela Matondkar's Enduring Legacy Ermela Matondkar's journey from a child artist to a Bollywood diva and now a politician has been nothing short of remarkable. She's a woman of many talents and her impact on Indian cinema and society is undeniable. Her impressive net worth is a testament to her hard work, business acumen and smart financial decisions. She's an inspiration to many, proving that with determination and talent, one can achieve their dreams. As she embarks on a new chapter in her life, we wish her all the best in her future endeavors. Ermela Matondka's legacy as a talented actress, a successful businesswoman, and a fearless woman will continue to inspire generations to come. And with that, we come to the end of another exciting episode of Coffee with Karen. Until next time, stay glamorous 